So, what are the liberal arts? Here at Wright State, it means a cluster of disciplines, established disciplines that train the mind to focus, not just on the what, but also on the how and the why. A liberal arts education is based on the development of essential skills and skill sets. Liberal arts graduates have creative, innovative thinking skills, advanced problem-solving capabilities, and the enhanced capacity to learn new things and adapt rapidly to our ever-changing world. Liberal arts grads communicate clearly and effectively, work well in teams, perform exacting research and data analysis, and bring a deeper understanding of our increasingly diverse world. And these skills prepare them well to excel in the jobs of today and tomorrow. The traditional liberal arts education, I mean, going back to the ancient Greeks, is teaching people how to think for themselves and how to solve problems and give us some sense of perspective, a sense of being part of something that's greater than ourselves. It's very important to have information and facts that can be backed up with data. People want to know what the facts are and what's the information and what are your sources. And if we can say it's, you know, it's all backed up, it's been done this way, and with empirical data, really getting a, a, a good solid base on um, what it takes to look at the data, go through the data, why it makes sense. The most important uh, skills that you get from a liberal arts education are being able to write, uh, to speak clearly, research, to go interview people, um, to ask the questions that make you go a little bit deeper. Definitely analysis, being able to take that information and synthesize it in some way um, to come to a new conclusion. The liberal arts at Wright State include the social sciences, the humanities, the fine and performing arts, and a group of interdisciplinary programs. The social sciences are focused on societal conditions and human behavior. From them we learn how to better understand the world's complex social systems and ways to improve them. I think liberal arts forces us to think beyond our own comfort zone. Take any problem that the world's facing right now. They're connected to culture, to history, to politics, to economics, to environmental issues. Think creatively, think critically. We have to know the context, know the background. I will design papers that force them to argue the opposite position that they hold. Trying to understand that there's multiple ways to approach issues. See how another person or group of people see the world. The humanities study culture as a means of helping us comprehend the past, present, and our future options. From them we learn how to better address the world's current issues and problems. Liberal arts is the place where we think about what we do and why we do it. Thinking your way through a problem, ways of reading and ways of writing that are pretty structured. Being able to hold multiple points of view in your head at the same time while all the time trying to filter and sort them out. Then it means you have to figure out what your place is in this world. The arts teach us about other people and ourselves through aesthetic expression. From them we learn how to better articulate the human experience and reach across multiple audiences on an emotional level. With a liberal arts education, we're adding humanity, human encounter to the education. It teaches you to think of problems differently. You're thinking about a problem from an analytical, from a critical point of view, so that you can innovate, genuinely innovate. Innovation is not about technical mastery. Innovation is about thinking of a problem in a new way. And our interdisciplinary programs cut across multiple subject areas in the arts, humanities, and social sciences. From them, we learn how to better prepare for this rapidly changing, increasingly multicultural world. So it doesn't really matter if you major in the social sciences, humanities, arts, or an interdisciplinary program. By studying any one of them, you will learn, hone, and master these essential liberal arts skills that have proven so vital for the jobs of today and tomorrow. An October 2013 Forbes magazine article featured the results of a survey of nearly 250 employers nationwide. When asked what skills they prioritize when hiring college grads, 
Among the top 10 responses involve the ability to work well in a team, make decisions and solve problems, obtain and process information, analyze quantitative data, communicate verbally, and create and or edit written reports. Skills you learn in a liberal arts education. In a 2013 Heart Research Associates survey of over 300 employers, 95% say they give hiring preference to college graduates with skills that will enable them to contribute to innovation in the workplace. 93% said a candidate's demonstrated capacity to think critically, communicate clearly, and solve complex problems is more important than their undergraduate major and 74% said they would recommend a liberal arts education to a young person they know as the best way to prepare for success in today's global economy. I think that being able to communicate and to have those analysis and research skills that you get from a liberal arts education apply no matter what field you decide to go into. I think some of the skill sets that are important, a lot of it is uh, communication. Uh, interacting with people. It's an analytical mindset uh, as well. Those are some of the skills that I think um, have benefited me personally uh, as I've gone through my career. That's why the liberal arts are just as important to modern civilization and future civilization as they were to ancient civilization. To take a broad, learned view of, of life. By studying the liberal arts, you'll learn extremely valuable skills. But once you own these essential skills, what will you do with them? Whatever you want. Because the liberal arts prepare you to do well in any endeavor forever, while giving you better habits of mind, different ways to engage with the world, and a richer and more complex life. So commit yourself to a major you love, do well in it, and know and market the importance of the skills you come away with. If you do that, you'll have the intellectual dexterity to see into problems that cannot yet be foreseen and be ready to help solve them. So please, join us here in Wright State's College of Liberal Arts.